I, I, tr I kind of describe it as like, I tend to think vertically, that if you take a slice out of what's going on, I'm always looking for, for the relationship between the, the strings to find ways of getting open strings in there to bring out the resonance of the guitar. And in relation to that, one of the things that I do when I'm holding the guitar is I keep it at 45 degrees to my body. So it's not like parallel to my body. Because if I do this, hang on, I need to, uh, yeah, you can hear it better with just the mic. Um, if, you, if you like put the guitar body against you, then you're gonna be muting the back. You can hear the difference. Same thing with the top. Area of the top is very lively, so if I if I like rest my forearm on the top, I lose I lose a lot of the bottom end of the guitar. But, I mean, you look at like bluegrass players that you know play like this; they're leaving this whole area of the top up. And you see illustrations of Renaissance lute players; they play it the same way. They just you know bring the arm in all the way from the end. And it does give you the opportunity to get more volume. Classical players will do that. Well, they'll hold the guitar way out in front of them so that they're not interfering with the vibration of the instrument.